Welcome to this channel. The channel is for educations and culture based on historical and scientific evidence. So last night I have a uh, discussions with uh, Wing Chun friends. He is asking me, can Wing Chun today be fixed? I told him it is beyond fixing. Today's Wing Chun is beyond fixing. So I share with him for half an hour why, what is the evidence that today's Wing Chun is beyond fixing. And today I like to make this video. <clears throat> so I share with the world what I share with these friends. Now, Wing Chun is beyond fixing. Wing Chun today is beyond fixings. It's also applied to Tai Chi, applied to most majority of Kung Fu. It is beyond fixing. The reason is, Today's Wing Chun, today's Tai Chi, and today's, in general, the Kung Fu is no longer what it is. The ancient Chinese uh, mean by Wing Chun or Tai Chi or Kung Fu. It is something else. In today's era, which is the information era, it is not that difficult to find out all those problem, the root cause, why it is beyond fixing. So let's start. Now, if we look at the data we have today in our hand in America, we have, say, this one is uh, General Chi Chi Guang, 1560s writing. This is his, uh, his, his, his teaching, his original writing. We have the 1850s, the Wing Chun Siu Lim Tao writing. So this is evidence. We can compare that, say, with the karate, the Olympic karate, okay? So this is a writing descriptions on Olympic karate. So you got the General Chi Chi Guang, you got the Wing Chun 1850, you can compare with it. And what you will find out is they are based on the same platform. It doesn't matter it is 1560, 1850, or today, 2023. Our clothing is different. But when you talk about martial art, it is based on the same platform. That we know. We can verify it. Okay, so this is Olympic descriptions. Okay, the, the, the karate. So... That part we know what is the ancient. When we compare the 1890 Wing Chun writing, which is today's uh, uh, mother of the Wing Chun today's, where Leong Zhan is using it, Tai Fa Ming Gam is using it, Yin Kei San, Yit Man, and uh, Gu Lo, and uh, everybody is using it. So this is a writing 1890. We compare it with Bob Fitzmon, Bob Fitzsimons, the uh, the real uh, the, the the boxing champions writing in the same time or the same era. You found that they have health training, strength training, they have breathing training. You know that you know right away this writing 
do not cover what Bob Phil Simons have in Western boxing to the very clearly it doesn't have the training of breathing and intra-abdominal pressure. Okay? And yet at, the, at that time in 1900, prior to the burning of Shaolin, the real Shaolin, not the movie, you know that in the Shaolin, even at 1900, the early 1900s, prior to the burning, they have that training of breathing and intra-abdominal pressure, which is supporting the martial arts. You know 1890 don't have it. So you know that at, 19, at 1890, the Wing Chun at that time already divert away from the martial art where over here uh, from 1560, 1850, it is consistent accord with today's Olympic, but the 1890s Wing Chun writing the scripture, which is everybody based on the three sets and the wooden dummy and the chi sao is no longer consistent with the martial of the world at the same era. And it have a loophole there. Okay? So it is starting to traveling to another direction. No longer as over here <clears throat> from the uh, 1560, 1850, which is consistent with uh, today's martial, which is in the same platform. Okay? So that is a reality. And of course, the Shaolin, because they are actually following the Chi Chi Quan, they are in this platform. Okay? So, it is a truth that nobody can avoid this. When you get into the history and in the component of Mashat, Hey, martial is about fighting. It's like battle. When you do battle, you better know what type of weapon do you have? What type of training do you have? Well, this is very obvious already. Okay? So this is not my opinion. This is evidence. How are you going to train this way and fight with like Bob Simmons? Or people who he trained, not to mention that this is a real champion who fought over the world. Okay, this is not. This is somebody's teaching. Okay, just make it clear. Now, let's look at 1560, General Chi Chi Kuang. General Chi Chi Kuang. So what is this in 1560? Well, today we know in that writing is talking about fighting is uh, dynamically playing the momentum game with distance, angle, and level change. At 1560, it divides into these three types of fighting. The long fist belong to this A, the short strike belong to this B and C, and the ground fighting, the Chinese ground fighting is this. This is 1560. And because they are playing with the momentum game, they are playing with momentum, different type of momentum variations, how one momentum changed to another momentum. Not techniques, but momentum, okay? This is all momentum game, not 10 techniques, because everything is based on momentum, okay? And then, this is the breathing part, as the Shaolin have, because the Shaolin is, uh, is following General Chi Chi Kuang since uh, the end of Ming Dynasty, like early 1600. Okay? So, I can share with you this.
Where do Shaolin Sok Strike Art originate? From Chi Chi Guang chapter 14. So whatever in Shaolin here, it is actually from the Chi Chi Guang book or teaching. So we need to get that part clear. Okay. Now, so this is Shaolin. This is Shaolin with their breathing training, intra abdominal pressure training, or their strengthening training. So the entire thing, 1560s Wing, uh, the uh, 1560s Kung Fu by General Chi Chi Guang have the momentum, the momentum play, the strengthening, the conditioning, the uh, the 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 uh, breathing and the intra abdominal pressure training to taking blow and prepare for fighting. That is what Chinese martial art is. Okay. That's why, as I have shared with you, this is Chi Chi Kuang, 1560s. It is consistent with today's Olympic karate type. It is a momentum play. Okay, now. So, where is this? Like this. Where, where is this like oh, reciting Buddha and uh, 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 tuning or adjusting your breathing, those things come from? Well, it is Buddhist. It is based on this. This, this two are Chinese uh, uh, Buddhist scripture writing in, in uh, which is uh, created in, uh, in, in, in China 1,500 years ago by the Buddhists. Okay? So it is uh, in this book, The Essence of Buddhist Meditations, uh, The Six Dharma Gates to the Sublime. They are based on, the Shaolin stuff are based on this. So, in today's language, this is a, a new development of the uh, Buddha's uh, Samatha and uh, Vipassana training. Okay? So, that's how clear it is. So, we know exactly what is the, the Shaolin Kung Fu, the Chi Chi Guang Kung Fu is about. So if you brought that to today, it looked like it is like a, it's no different than a MMA. It's only the clothing is different. Today I, I wear this hood with the, the, the poly, polymer fabrics and everything. If you go back uh, in 1560, they wear cotton. But when you talk about fighting, when all this clothing take apart, it is the same thing at least in the same platform. They do research, they do uh, a study into momentum, how momentum change, how momentum, one momentum uh, uh, vary to another momentum to fight. That is the name of the game. Now, so we know what is the, uh, the real, the true Chinese Kung Fu is about based on evidence, not Hendrick's uh, uh, opinion, okay? Now, so what went wrong? I want to introduce you to, uh, to this, uh, this gentleman. This gentleman uh, was uh, living in the early 1900. This is Mr. Tang Hao the uh, Chinese martial art historian. He studied martial art his, uh, history. At 1930, he pointed out that, he pointed out that, like uh, the Tai Chi at that time is talking, Zhan San Feng, the Taoist, is the one who create the Tai Chi. So you have this uh, Taoist stuff. After he studied, Tang Hao studied, he pointed out that it is not true. And he used a lot of uh, evidence, historical evidence to prove that both Bodhidharma and Zhan San Feng do not know martial arts. 
okay? And so he said that, whoever said that uh, the Tai Chi is uh, beginning from the Zhan Sang Feng from Wudang, the Taoist, it is just a made up. Okay? So this is happened around 1937. People know. Okay? So at 1928, <coughs> Hang Hao already uh, used uh, comparison scientific history method to do investigations on Chinese martial arts. And he promote Chinese martial art must map into science. This is 100 years ago. Okay, now, so in his book, he pointed out that the story of Wang Zhennan, who, who, which was a very famous story today about this uh, Zhan San Feng create the uh, Tai Chi and Zhan San Feng learn the, uh, the art uh, from this, uh, from this uh, god when he was dreaming. So in one night he dreamed and then he learned all this Tai Chi or whatever internal art. The next day he can kill all, about hundreds of, uh, of, uh, of, uh, of bandit or anything. The, uh, the, the, the Tang Hao Tang Hao, he wrote a book to debunk that, okay? To point out, hey man, this is just made up. Okay, so this is uh, the, the, the guy who made up all this thing. He lived Wang Zhennan, 1670, uh, 17 to 1669. This is the end of the, uh, the, the, uh, the Ming Dynasty. Okay, so this is the epitaph. This is called Wang Zhennan epitaph, saying that, oh, you know, uh, Tai Chi is better, or internal art is better than external, Shaolin, the external, and then it dream and, and all kinds of stuff. Okay? And also, Tang Hao pointed out all the story of Ji Sim Mui. Okay? Those are actually following a fiction called Wan Nian Qing, which is written by a Cantonese uh, gentleman. It is a fiction. It's called Wan Nian Qing. So you all have this burning of Shaolin and all this. Those are all fiction. The 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 the, uh, the Ji Sim and all this kind of thing. So hundred years ago, Hang Hao already found it out. All of the story of internal art is much superior. It is from Chan San Feng. It is Taoist. And then the uh, Bodhidharma uh, teaching the Shaolin, and then the uh, Ji Sim and Mui and all this, all are made up. None of it is truth. Okay? And actually, 100 years ago, they already found out that Tai Chi, Chen family Tai Chi, have took 29 of the 32 momentum of uh, General Chi Chi Guang's uh, momentum, okay, which is I put on my book, Kung Fu 15, uh, Kung Fu 1560. I already translate that. Actually, it's not translate. Describe it clearly what the heck it is because up to today, this is the only book to tell you what the heck is going on. What is the real Chinese Kung Fu? So, People have found out 100 years ago that Chen Tai Chi actually took 29 momentum out of the Chi Chi Guang 30 moment, 32 momentum to make their Tai Chi. And actually the country, today's China, uh, the, 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 the uh, physical education department have already uh, ensured that is what it is. Uh, and here it say that Tai Chi is from Chi Chi Guang. Uh, it cannot be earlier than Chi Chi Guang. Tai, the, 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 uh, the starting, the founding of the Tai Chi martial art cannot uh, precede 
general Chi Chi Guang, and it got nothing to do with Zhang San Feng. Okay, so uh, it is not what the 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 young Tai Chi talk about. The Tai Chi is from Zhang San Feng, while young Tai Chi is also uh, is a offspring from the Chen Tai Chi. So, what well, people know about it? Okay, that is the reality. Now, so you got it. All of those are made up, and people know about it. Even the today, the, the, the Chinese uh, uh, physical department, uh, physical uh, training de department know that. Okay, or sport department, those uh, uh, physical education department know those things. So you want the truth? Okay. Now another thing is because. People is talking about, you know, like all this, this fake stuff saying that, oh, you know, Tai Chi or internal is from Taoist, blah, blah, blah. Taoists have a better thing. And then starting, you have this, this Qi, and then you have this, uh, what, uh, this, uh, this uh, golden elixir, alchemy, you know, like in the book, The Secret of a Golden Flower. What happened is this. So Richard Wilhelm at that time went to China, okay? He got this book, the, so he translated it. This is the secret of the golden flower. And then uh, C.G. Jung uh, commentary on it. So this book, right? So after that, right away, the Chinese said, you see, the, 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 the Westerner also uh, think that this is proper, blah, blah, blah. So there's the secret of the golden flower, and then you got this uh, golden uh, elixir, alchemy, all this thing. But guess what? Up to today, there is none evident that any of the Westerner have arrived to the true understanding and true practice of the secret of golden flower. But they take it as philosophy. Okay? And then you get into this emptiness stuff. Well, when it comes to the West, it, it, it becomes a philosophy. Everybody have their five cents and the Chinese look at that and say, you know, Chinese love to do this. When the Westerner uh, 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 like study some Chinese stuff, then they will say, you see, that uh, Westerner, they study this too. You know? That means uh, our Chinese culture is much at, at once. Then he make that Westerner become the grandmaster. Disregard that the, the Westerner know what the heck they are talking about or not. Okay? So it is like you pat my back, I pat your back. You just uh, look there, and then uh, and then you, you 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 snowball, and everybody suddenly become all grandmaster, all expert. But none of them know what the heck is going on with the the the, the ancient Chinese. So you say, well, Hendrik, how the hell you know? Well, I know why, because the real Chinese Taoists. As in this writing, the Ling Yan Ta Tao Ge, this is a writing by a female Taoist. He, she was uh, invited to, uh, to the palace, <coughs> to, actually to the, uh, yeah, to the palace to, to, uh, to, to, uh, to meet the, the emperor, emperor's people, you know, the, the officials. And uh, this, uh, this Chao Yi Wen, this uh, female Taoist, is actually one of the granddaughter of a very fam famous general in the Song Dynasty. He left the entire Taoist writing. It's called Ling Yan Da Tao Ge. Whoever is serious on cultivate Tao, this book is, is well known for, for uh, since 1,000 years ago. Now, in this writing, in this writing, the first is said this, I will tell you the truth. Okay, here, let me just uh, do a really quick, quick, uh, quick translation. 
I will tell, I will tell you, you all gentlemen the truth. The root of life is in the true breath. True breath. Well, true breath. So what the heck is this true breath? Well, it turns out that if you get closely down here, over here it says that do not hold your breath and thinking that is true. If you count your breath, just following the, the usually like the, 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 the teaching, general teaching, and count the breath, that is not it. What is counting breath? Well, that is the what the Buddha's training, uh, the Buddhism's, uh, the Buddha's teaching of training in the uh, breath counting. The Anapanasati. Okay. So it get back to this book. It get back to this book. Okay, so the Taoists, we know that 1,000 years ago, when the real Taoists actually, they have a really deep cultivation in this, uh, uh, in this uh, or handling of profession in the Buddhist Anapanasati, Samatha and Vipassana. And thus, when uh, this, uh, this, this female Taoist, Cao Yiwen, okay, when he wrote this, this really, uh, really important Taoist uh, article, it, told, it, it, it said right away, the root of the life is in the true breath. And inside the content he mentioned about is not blindly follow the counting the breath, is not holding your breath. Now, that is the truth. It's not all your, oh yeah, you know, today it is the golden flower. Tomorrow it is the what the heck flower. And then you say the golden elicil akemi. Okay. And then it's the emptiness. Oh, what the heck is this? It's just all words, but you don't know what is it. Anybody who really good in Taoist, they know that they get into those anapanasati stuff, the samatha and the vipassana. Because Disregard you are Chinese, you are Indian, you are American, who you are as soon as you are human, you're going to travel the same path when you want to get down, down deep into your, 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 your human physiology. Well, I want to tell you one thing about this golden, golden elysium. Okay? This is Yongzhen. <coughs> Yongzhen is the emperor you always see in the movie that he's the guy, bad guy who burned the Shaolin. Okay, that's the movie, not the real thing. Okay, so they use, they, they don't like Yongzhen. They, 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 they wrote a lot of fictions about him. This is the Qing emperor. Guess how he died? He died because he is practicing those Golden elixirs alchemy. Okay. Intake all kinds of uh like uh all kinds of the the the, the alchemy uh minerals. Okay, one of it like the mercury. So he is practicing like what like today is everybody go to buy supplement i buy i eat this supplement i can get me long life and all this thing the emperor too bad he died so he have all the people who surrounding him of course those uh, those uh, those uh, those uh, those uh, uh, fake people in every time every era you have those fake people surrounding him and say well boss you no know, just take this take this take this uh, practice this uh, this, 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 this alchemy, and uh, you will be, well, you end up, he died, okay? So you want to practice this thing? You, you want to keep making up story and all this nonsense? Just because of, 
I think the Chinese saying this, I have a, a PhD in Sinology. Do you know what the heck is bottom there? Anybody who really know how to, you know, the in-depth of the Taoist for sure is going to hit this, uh, this article and is going to go away. Is going to go investigate in this thing, these two books. This is a translation. Not very close, but at least you know what the heck the content of it. So, so that's what it is. Okay, now. So just now I have tell you, 100 years ago, Tang Hao already debunked, exposed all this internal nonsense, okay? Or uh, Zhan San Fung create internal and Bodhidharma create the external martial arts, okay? And then all this Qi, and then all this, uh, what? Uh, the, the burning of Shaolin, okay? And you see as here, the, the Tai Chi people took from Chi Chi Guang, but did they give credit? No, they say, well, this is from Zhan San Fung. And then you bring into this uh, the, the, the Qi, the, the, the golden Alice's. Well, do you know that the emperor died because of that? And do you know that? Stop to talk about this emptiness or anything until you go check into this and really know what the heck you're talking about. Or everybody get a PhD. I just saw many, many translations of PhD dissertations or master degree thesis. It's nonsense. You know that that is the professor have no clue, is clueless, and the students clueless. And then you feel that in the in the West today, everybody is Taoist. You wear a Taoist clothes. That's why I rather wear a NASA jacket here. Okay. It, it is it is this this screw up. Okay. The Chinese doesn't know what it is that the. the the uh, Westerner doesn't know what it is, and everybody want to be grandmaster. Everybody want to be expert. Oh, I'm the scholar. Scholar for what? Have you reached this? Uh, uh, this uh, states. Now, when you get to martial arts, let, let's not uh, let's not kidding uh, 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 ourselves. When you get to martial arts, let's not kidding ourselves. Okay. The reality is this is by Bruce Lee in 1969. 50 years ago, Bruce Lee said, I lost faith. I lost faith in Chinese classical arts. And he called, all style are, produ are produced of land swimming, even the Wing Chun school. 50 years ago, Bruce already said that. Who said that Bruce is supporting Wing Chun? Bruce doesn't support Wing Chun. Bruce tell you the truth. It is land swimming. Of course, he found out. He had to fight. Bruce had to fight, right? Now, so right now, three years ago, four years ago, today is 2023. So uh, in 20, uh, 2018, you, you know the Xi Xiao Dong challenged the Tai Chi guy. He said uh, Xi Xiao Dong is uh, beating up the, uh, the, the, the Tai Chi. And then this is uh, 40, 47 second KO, the Wing Chun uh, pressure point grandmaster. This is reality. You like it or not, for the 50 years, past 50 years, this is reality. Okay? So today's Wing Chun is what? The same today's Wing Chun or Tai Chi or, or, or whatever Kung Fu, it turned out to be movie stuff like this, right? Or like this, Chi stuff, right? Or like this, okay? Uh, Yip Man versus the boxer, Yip Man versus the Kyokutin, because they don't, they don't dare to say Kyokushin. But they, you know, when you cannot fight in the Kyokushin open, you make a movie, you say, well, I'm fight Kyokutin. It, it is completely... It is just living in a fantasy, you know. So what 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 is all this thing do? This is no different than may the force be with you, the Yoda. Okay, the same thing, but people believe on it. And what did they this thing preach? It is preaching magic. 
magic chi, magic mind power, and then uh, it promotes violence. Talk with your hand, not talk with your mouth. The thing, the entire thing as what I share with you is completely off the, the, the reality of martial arts. It's completely off the, re, uh, the reality of martial arts. Which is, if you use the Olympic standard as, as the reference, it's completely off that way. People in Olympic, or today in MMA, they are studying, they are researching on momentum handling, how you take down, how you striking and all those things and kicking and everything is all momentum. So five, uh, 450 years ago, General Chi Chi Guang already summarized the entire thing. But all this thing, for past 100 years, all this Tai Chi stuff, uh, this, uh, this, uh, this Chi stuff, uh, this uh, golden peel, uh, elixir stuff, this uh, emptiness stuff. What is it? Okay, so it become what? It become a cult. So today's Kung Fu, Wing Chun or Tai Chi is a cult. People believe on that. Okay? And as what I say here, you see, 50 years ago, Bruce Lee already said that this is his writing, not my writing. Wing Chun is land swimming. Five years ago, four years ago, five years ago now, Xi Xiaodong in China already proved to you all your Tai Chi and Wing Chun stuff doesn't work. But you're still keeping making movie. Okay, and everybody still may the force be with you, the grandmaster, this grandmaster, that. What if that is not a cult? What it is? Now, how do you fix something like this? How, how do you fix something like that when Bruce Lee 50 years ago, Bruce is a much better fighter and martial artist than me have already tell you. It is a land swimming. Five years ago, the, our MMA friend, uh, Xi Xiaodong, have proved to you that it is land swimming. It's fake Chinese Kung Fu. Are you still going for that? Okay. What did the Chinese do this? I just explained to you just now. None of that. Right? I just explained to you. This is what the Chi Chi Quan go for. None of those things, which is, uh, which is uh, in this movie and all this thing, in this movie and uh, uh, all the chi and uh, make believe, may the force be with you. None. Zero. So how are you going to fix things like that? You cannot fix. It's beyond fixing. Because everybody is brainwashed. And of course, this is a democratic free, uh, free world. Everybody can believe what they want. So when yesterday our friend asked me about can it be fixed, I said it cannot be fixed. Why? Because everybody is going that direction of a cult. He won't listen. If people don't even listen to Bruce Lee 50 years ago and still selling Wing Chun at using movie, who the hell is going to listen to me? I am no Bruce Lee. I am maybe 1,000 times smaller than Bruce Lee. Bruce Lee is 1,000 times better than me. Okay? Nobody is going to listen to me, I'm sure. Even though I put the evidence in front, even... So, again, Bruce already tell you 50 years ago, you are walking into a delusion. So, I wrote this book, Decoding Wing Chun. I just released this a month ago. That is to, 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 to capture, to tell what is the truth of Wing Chun, 1850. Okay, this is the Chi Chi Quang momentum. And then the body conditioning. You have the Chi neurosing, the fitness training, the strengthening training. Now you can have the, uh, the, the, the spot tracker to track all these things if you really have the Kung Fu. You talk about the breathing, the intra-abdominal pressure. 
Okay, so I am just making it scientifically in today's language to present this. To present this part. To present all the basic of this, which is is based on, as described in the eighteen fifties writing. Okay, so again, don't give me those nonsense on uh on this, nonsense on on uh, the. The, uh, the, the golden flower, the, uh, the golden elixir alchemy, uh, the emptiness. You know what? That's why in this book, in this book, I put all the heart rate, heart rate variability, the heart rate variability, every measurement, scientific measurement. If you want to tell me about your uh, emptiness or might be able to have the cheat, you better be able to give me, to show me your data of your heart rate, heart rate variability, your breathing and everything. If you don't, that means you are selling bullshit, okay? And if you look at this, even 100 years ago, 100 years ago, hundred years ago, our friend Robert Fitzsimons have a clear system, a scientific stuff. And then, uh, like uh, Tang Hao, I just shared with you, he wants scientific too. So, how am I supposed to tell you all this? Should I keep my mouth shut and get everybody down to the tube? Or tell you, hey, 100 years ago, somebody say it is, it is already a mess. It is a cult. 50 years ago, Uncle Bruce Lee already tell you that is a land swimming. Five years ago, the uh, Xi Xiaodong proved to you it doesn't work. When people like the MMA Olympic and Qi Ji Kuang 400 years ago is keeping, investigate, study, perfecting their, their, their momentum handling, Oh, you 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 strike it with a strike him with a jab and going down with a takedown, all kind of stuff. You're talking about hand techniques and then have chi, have mind power. How how is it supposed to fix uh, to be fixed? So should I kiss everybody's ass and let the entire world die and look like idiot everybody in the in the in the ancient because of somebody one decide to create this cult? So that the ancient Chinese is idiot. Bruce Lee is idiot. Everybody is idiot. You guys are, are the, the god, the, uh, the, the real deal. Or should I tell the entire world, hey man, this is what happened. Okay? Stop to uh, 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 distorting and uh, misleading people on what the Chinese presenting. And if today you want to talk about your Taoist and everything, you better get a... a a spot tracker and be able to back your claim with your heart rate, your heart rate variability, your breathing rate. You have to be able to be able to handle it. The ancient Chinese be able to handle it. It like uh, I just shared just now. The Taoists, the, the female Taoists, they practice deep into the samatha. And today in Harvard, anybody who really have that, uh, that, that, that capability, you can see that they can drop their breathing un down to six breaths per minute and all this kind of thing. So the ancient Chinese and today's us in America have no difference. It's only the only difference is probably uh, I have glasses like this. They don't have. I have the spot trackle. Uh, I, know I have this hoodies like this. They, they wear a different thing. They eat different things. And so the question now asks, where is all this thing created in the past 100 years is from? Or this internal art people create is from? It's nowhere. It is a marketing deal. So how are we going to fix something like that? There's no way it's beyond fixing if you're keeping doing like that. Movie and all this, like a Jedi, uh, Yoda, may the force with you. Can you find any Yoda in this world? So there is no way to fix all this Wing Chun stuff. 
The only thing you can do is follow what the ancient, the real teaching. No longer my grandmaster say this, my lineage say this, I have this power. Forget about it. To all those people who keep being saying that, I say, hey, no, I just pulled down just now. Bruce Lee tell you 50 years ago, it's all land swimming. It means it doesn't work. How can you fix that? If Bruce Lee cannot fix it, there's no way I, I know how to fix it. So the only way is follow what the ancient, and the ancient is in the same directions with the Olympic anyway. So you don't need to fix it. You just drop the entire BS. Just following what is the truth. 